my last question is on, on a, I guess, a more sort of personal, professional level. I just wondered, you are, in certain ways, a minority twice over. You're a Christian in a field that is probably not dominated by Christians. And you're a woman in a field mm -hmm. that is sort of assumed to be male-dominated and often assumed to be a difficult field for a woman for that reason. And I wonder if, I mean, maybe neither of those, mm -hmm. maybe neither your beliefs nor your sex has ever felt like a difficulty or an impediment in your field, but I just wonder if how, how you've experienced that combination and if sort of mm -hmm. either one has seemed to make you, make you more distinctive in a good way or alienated in a bad way from your peers and your profession. Mm -hmm. First of all, I, th I think being a woman in technology and science is fabulous. It's a great career for a woman. It's a career where you can bring a lot of creativity, flexibility, and we value different perspectives, different ways of seeing things. So kind of the more different you are, the more you can fit in. Uh, that said, I, I do feel like there are expectations, and if you do sort of the same quality work, they just expect it's not as good because you're a woman or... or you're blonde, or you're from the South, or you're Christian, <laughs> oh gosh, you know, or my goodness, was that something conservative you were reading, you know, over there? So, you can just tell people, it's the New York Times, you know. It's right, just, right, yeah, the, the Times is okay in academia, you know, but I actually read the Wall Street Journal, oh, you know, well. sorry. <laughs> but it's, uh, well, actually, I read the Times too, but I read a diversity of things, whereas some of my colleagues pretty much, you know, come from one angle. But I think our community as a whole is so international and diverse that we, we welcome uh, people whose viewpoints are really different because we know from the past that they make contributions that are valuable, that seeing something the same way all the time uh, just gets you stuck. Well, this has been great. Thank you so much for having this conversation. Mm -hmm.